students welcome in other education channel today we are going to solve practice set 6.2 so let us start first question radius of a circle is 10 cm there are two cords of length 16 cm each what will be the distance of this cord from the center of the circle here diagram is not given first from the given information we will draw the diagram see this is circle with center O. Here, how many chords are given? Two chords are given. See. There are two chords. See. A, B and C, D are the two chords. O is the center of the circle. And length of the radius is 10 cm. Length of the radius is 10 cm. Here, O, B and O, D are the radius which are given. 10 cm and the length of the cord is given 16 cm means AB and CD are the 16 cm and what you have to find OM and ON aapko ye find out karna hai OM and ON 16 16 two cords given radius 10 means OB is the radius 10 OD is also radius 10 cm you can find out the OM and ON See, this is the given. Let the center of the circle be O and let segment AB and segment CD are the given congruent chords. Segment OM is perpendicular to the segment AB. See, this OM is perpendicular to the segment AB such that M is between A and B and segment ON is perpendicular to the chord CD such that N is between C and D. See from the given information here what is given? Radius is given 10 cm. Here which is the radius? OB. Hmm? Means OB and OD are the radius. Means OB is equal to OD is equal to 10 cm. Radius of the circle is 10 cm. Huh? This is given and the chords are also given 16 cm. Hmm? Which are the chords? AB and CD. AB is equal to CD is equal to 16 cm. This is also given. This is also given in the question. Now see the perpendicular drawn from the center of the circle to the chord bisect the chord. Therefore, MB is equal to half of AB. See perpendicular drawn from the center of the circle to the chord bisect the chord. Therefore, MB is equal to half of AB. Half of AB is given how much? 16. Half of 16 is 8. 8 centimeter. MB is equal to 8 centimeter. Now see OMB. This is right angle triangle. Hmm? See MB is 8 centimeter. Just we have found out. This is 8 centimeter. And this radius is given 10 centimeter. Using Pythagoras theorem, we will find out the value of OM. Now, in right angle triangle, OMB by Pythagoras theorem, by Pythagoras theorem, hypotenuse square here, which is the hypotenuse. O B. O B square is equal to O M square plus M B square. Now put the values O B is 10. 10 square is equal to O M is not given plus M B is how much? 8 square. 10 square 100. 8 square 64. This 64 comes to opposite side minus. 100 minus 64 is equal to OM square 100 minus 64 36 
O M square is equal to thirty six. Now taking square root, O M is equal to six centimeter. Hmm? O M is equal to six centimeter. See these two are the congruent chords. Hmm? The congruent chords. are equidistant equidistant from the center of the circle huh? these two chords are the equidistant therefore this distance is also equal om is equal to O n, O m is equal to O n. O m is how much? Six centimeter. Therefore, O n is also six centimeter. Means the distance of the given course. from the center of the circle is 6 cm hmm? see this distance is 6 cm now question number 2 next question in a circle with radius 13 cm two equal chords are at a distance of 5 cm from the center find the length of the chord see this is the circle with center o ab and cd are the chord and the radius is given 13 cm here ob and od is the radius both are 13 cm and the two equal chords are at the distance of 5 cm from the center means from the center and the chord this distance is 5 cm huh? means om is 5 on is also 5 and you can find out the length of the chord means you can find out this length of the chord you can find out ab and cd you can write down the center of the circle bo let the segment ab and cd be the given congruent chords segment OM is perpendicular to the segment AB such that M is between A and B and segment ON is perpendicular to the segment CD such that N is between C and D radius of the circle is 13 cm this is already given from the given you can draw the diagram see here which is the radius OB and OD therefore OB is equal to OD is equal to how much given 13 Centimeter. Now see in right angle triangle OMB. See this is right angle triangle in right angle triangle. Right angle triangle OMB by Pythagoras theorem. By Pythagoras theorem. here which is the hypotenuse ob ob square is equal to om square plus mb square now put the values ob is 13 13 square plus om is 5 square plus mb square 13 square is 169 Five square twenty five plus m b square one sixty nine minus twenty five is equal to m b square one sixty nine minus twenty five one forty four is equal to m b square. Now taking the square root, m b is equal to one forty four is square of twelve. Means m b is equal to twelve centimeter. You can find out the a b. All of you know the perpendicular drawn from the center of the circle to the chord bisect the chord. 
you got this half distance huh? mb is equal to 12 so total kitna hoga 12 plus 12 24 hmm? first mb is equal to half of ab hmm? mb is how much 12 12 is equal to half of ab this 2 is divided it equals to opposite side multiply 12 multiplied by 2 is equal to ab 12 to the 24 therefore ab is equal to 24 centimeter now you will get the first chord ab is equal to 24 centimeter but in the question both the chords are congruent ab and cd are congruent you will get the value of ab is equal to 24 means cd is also 24 centimeter i'm writing here next chord ab congruent to chord cd therefore cd is also 24 centimeter this is given uh, both the chords are congruent this is already given in the question therefore the length of each of the two equal chords of the circle is 24 centimeter now next question question number three segment pm and segment pn are congruent chords of the circle with center c show that the ray pc is a bisect of angle and pm here diagram is not given but you can draw the diagram from the given information See here what is given PN and PM are the congruent chords of the circle. See this is the PN and PM. These are the chords of the circle with center C. C is the center of the circle. You can show that the ray PC, this ray is PC, bisect the angle NPM. This NPM angle hai. वो ये रे PC बायसेक्ट कर रहा है वो हमें दिखाना है प्रूफ ड्रॉ सेगमेंट CN एंड सेगमेंट CM नाउ इन ट्रायंगल CPM एंड ट्रायंगल CPN सी दिस टू ट्रायंगल CPM एंड CPN इन दिस टू ट्रायंगल्स we are showing first these two triangles are congruent. Segment PM is congruent with segment PN. See, segment PM is congruent with segment CA. Why? Because these are the congruent chords and this is already given. This is given. Congruent chords. This is given. Now next segment PC is congruent to segment PC. See, this PC is common side segment PC congruent to segment PC. This is common side. Common side. Now, segment CM congruent to segment CN. Why? Because these are the radii of the circle. Segment CM congruent to segment cn what is the reason radii of the same circle therefore triangle cpm congruent to triangle cpn by which test side 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 these two triangles are congruent by SSS test of congruency. Test of congruency. Now, these two angles are congruent by SSS test. Therefore, angle CPM congruent with angle CPN angle. CPM congruent with angle CPN. These two angles are congruent. Why congruent angles of congruent triangles? Congruent angles of congruent triangle. Huh? You can write down in short form. 
CACT congruent angle of congruent triangle therefore ray PC is the bisector of angle N P M these two angles are congruent therefore ray PC is the bisector of angle N P M thanks for watching the video please like share and subscribe my channel for more videos